Hey, what's up you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is an honest review of Glasses USA. Are they really that affordable? Are they worth the hype? And should you get a pair from Glasses USA? So a lot of YouTubers obviously get sponsored by Glasses USA and they always rave about how amazing the glasses are, how good quality they are, how affordable they are. The main thing that they pride themselves on is how affordable they are compared to buying glasses at your eye doctor, which that can be really expensive and sometimes the eye doctor doesn't have what you need. For example, my eye doctor doesn't do the blue light protection and that is mainly what I was looking for. I was looking for prescription glasses that had blue light protection on top because I do spend a lot of time on my laptop and I don't want my eyesight getting worse. I actually filmed my first reaction to when I got the glasses, which was a little bit, no, it was exactly two weeks ago. So I'll insert that footage here. So I just got a package, yeah, let me show you this, from Glasses USA. It is the glasses that I ordered a couple weeks ago. Uh, it's taken forever to get here, uh, which is fine. I don't care about that. So let's open it. They come in this little box. Oh, and it comes with a case. I ordered, I forget what they're called. Okay. There's a lot of things in this box. Let's start off with the glasses. There are sat in there. And because I ordered from the Muse and Hilary Duff collaboration, I got some stickers. How cute. As for those stickers that I got, I actually put them on my laptop. So, let me see. So this one, it came in that pack. Let's see. That cherry one, that camera. This one says, what does it See the world through rose colored glasses. The little, Glasses there. Yeah, I think those were all of them that I put. Those are the ones that are just on my laptop. There's a couple that are on my bullet journal, I want to say. Oh, wait. This little rose is also from that pack. <laughs> and yeah. A little pamphlet with Hilary Duff. What style did I get? I forget what style I got. Anyway, what's this? Oh, this is a little like microfiber cloth. Oh, that's cute. It says don't use your t-shirt. Which I mean, you shouldn't be using your t-shirt. You should use the cloth, but you know, tough times. Oh, this has my prescription on it. And it gives me, what is it? 25% off my next order. I have up to $40 off my next order. Huh. What is this? They have so many little things in here. Oh. Okay, that's... Anyway, let's get to the actual glasses part. Still, is there not like a package slip or anything? So that, these are the glasses. I know, I think they're the Sarah frames. I'm really not sure. But I know what color they're in. They're in the color brick. This is what they look like. They don't feel, I mean, I paid 60 bucks, I think. They don't feel like super high quality, but they also don't feel super cheap, which is good. And that's how they look like. I have my mirror right here, sorry. They don't look half bad. The color isn't what it looked like. 
in the picture online, I think. I'm not sure because I ordered these so long ago. Yeah, these are the Sarah in the color brick. So this is what they look like. Honestly, oh wow. Okay, I see a difference. I was gonna say, I don't see a difference. I mean, I don't have like a big prescription. My prescription isn't, I'm sorry about the ring light. My prescription isn't very big. So overall, they kind, they feel a little flimsy. I'm not gonna lie. Like this part that looks like it's metal is plastic. But the fit of them is really good. And the I did their picture test where you pick a picture of yourself and then you can try on the glasses. I did that. And I would say it's pretty true to what it looked like online on me, like the frames. So I'm pretty happy with it. With how much I paid for it, I wasn't expecting like, Ray-Ban kind of quality. Obviously you have to pay for that, but not bad. I will say not bad. And now I just have to see how they hold up. But yeah, I think that's everything. I like that I got stickers with it though. I think that was a major plus. I don't think you'll get stickers with all of them though. Had them for two weeks. I've been wearing them pretty much every day since I got them, uh, give or take a couple days because I didn't need to wear them. So I got the Muse and Hilary Duff Sarah lenses. So the lenses, any Sarah lens is gonna look like this. Uh, this is in the brick color which now that I have it pulled up on my laptop does not look <laughs> like the color on the website but I'll pop in a picture so you can see it looks darker than what I actually got I don't know it just looks darker to me um let's see they were discounted, so the lenses were originally $98. I got them for $68. And the blue light cost an additional $19. But I had a discount somewhere in there and free shipping. So they went from $68 to $58.20. That's how much I ended up paying for the glasses as a whole. And yeah, so really they only cost me 60 bucks compared to the hundred somewhat dollars that I would have paid at the eye doctor. Um, they have blue light, which is what I wanted. I mean, they get dirty like any other glasses. And so far they've survived being thrown inside my purse, being thrown just on my nightstand or my desk, which not gonna lie, they're always a mess. So that's, those are some rough conditions. But yeah, this is what they look like on. The actual lenses don't look bad on me. And I mean, the actual frames, not lenses, right? I don't know. They don't look bad on me. Um, I will say their feature where you can upload a picture of yourself, it's really handy and it is pretty true to what you actually see when you put it on. It did say that it would take around seven to 10 business days, but that was so not true. They took forever to get here. Uh, from this, it tells me I ordered them July 9th. I ended up getting the glasses August 2nd, but that's not necessarily like a thing that I would dock them points for because first off, we're in a pandemic. Second off, glasses do take a while to make. So it's understandable. And for the price, the quality of the frames is not bad at all. So they obviously have more premium frames on their website. I mean, they have Ray-Ban and other designer frames. 
that you could try out but for just their basic frames i guess not bad i mean it has the blue light which is what i wanted and you can definitely tell a difference when you've been on your laptop for a while and i've definitely noticed a difference with the amount of headaches that i get uh also driving at night is easier and driving with rain is also easier um maybe because now i can actually see where before i cannot the frames look good on me they always throw out really good sales and offers and honestly for you pay for what you get and there's nothing bad about that so take it however you want really overall i give it like an 8 out of 10 they're not bad they're not great you get what you pay for basically and i would honestly buy from them again <clears throat> is it worth the hype That's a question. <laughs> they're kind of worth the hype not fully but not it's not a no either i think it depends on what you get from molasses usa eight out of ten for me i think like the quality could be better, but then again, I only paid 60 bucks. So if I want Ray-Ban quality glasses, I should get Ray-Ban, Ray-Bans, you know? Anyway, that is it for this video. I hope you liked it. Please get a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe, comment. Do all that stuff <laughs> uh for my friends thank you for being a true supporter i i appreciate it um anyway i'll talk to you in the next one bye